Hello friends, this is Maitri bringing yum 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 recipes to your kitchen. Today I'm going to show you how to make a quick easy Chinese fried rice. This is my rescue recipe for lunch box whenever I have the leftover rice. So the recipe is very simple and it can be done in 15 minutes. So let's get started with the recipe. The ingredients to make this recipe are 2 cups of cooked white rice, uh, half cu uh, 1 fourth cup of cabbage, half cup of broccoli, half cup of mixed vegetable frozen, and some salt, crushed red pepper, ground black pepper, and some hot sauce, three racha sauce, and uh, one tablespoon of um, soya sauce, and some oil. So to make this recipe, I'm using the wok. So wok is always best because you need to stir fry the rice on high heat. Uh, then only you will get the authentic Chinese taste. The secret uh, sauce for this recipe, in my recipe for this uh, Chinese fried rice is three ingredients. Uh, first is crushed red pepper and the thinly sliced cabbage and the broccoli. So without these three ingredients I will never make this recipe. So the, now the oil is hot. So for the non-stick pan I added one tablespoon of oil. Oil is hot. So when the oil is hot, use the crushed red pepper. With this, the oil becomes infused with the red pepper and then it gives a very nice spicy taste for your Chinese fried rice. So in wok, things will get heat up very quickly. So immediately add your thinly sized cabbage. Give it a stir. Sort this for around 30 seconds done so you don't want to uh, cook cabbage or vegetables too much in this recipe because you want to keep the nice bright color and the crunch of these vegetables so to the pan I'm adding mixed vegetable I have already uh, microwaved it for two minutes they are already little soft so now I've added that to the wok so let's give another quick stir for one minute so that the vegetables will get sorted with the oil now the vegetables are sorted here. So to this now I'm going to add soya sauce. I'm using dark soya sauce for very rich bright color. You can use any soya sauce, light soya sauce. Now to this, I'm going to add freshly ground black pepper. Give a nice quick stir. See the dark soya sauce gave very nice color. So I think at this point we don't want to sort anymore. To add rice, this is two cups of cooked rice. And this needs to, this shouldn't be hot at all. It's, I mean, it's better when it is leftover rice because the rice needs to be a little bit uh, firm so that it shouldn't have any water. So if you don't have leftover rice, uh, if you have to make this with fresh rice, then it's better to keep in the fridge for 30 minutes so that the rice will become firm. Okay, now. The rice is getting coated with vegetables and oil. Keep the heat in, the, in high and then keep stirring. The taste of this recipe lies in the stir frying. Okay. To this, I'm going to add hot sauce right now. Here I'm using free racha sauce or you can use chili garlic sauce as well. After adding hot sauce, give another quick stir on high. So now I'm going to add salt. Keep on stirring. And it's almost got the consistency. To this, I've already microwaved broccoli for one minute. Add broccoli. Broccoli added really nice color to this rice. So it's almost done. Taste and edges. Your salt and seasoning. You 
Okay, looks like the Chinese fried rice is ready. So let's transfer this to serving bowl. Okay, I have transferred the rice from wok to the bowl. This is all ready to be served. Uh, so I'm going to give a taste test to this. This already looks beautiful. It really tasted very good and it got the kick from the hot sauce and all the vegetables are very crunchy in this rice. Okay, the recipe is very simple and can be made very quickly and it's going to be a perfect lunchbox recipe uh, with your leftover rice. So I think, uh, I hope you like this video. I'll be back with another great recipe. Until then, take care and bye-bye.